Com or download the app to search local, find local, and save local. The Fox 17 Weather Report is brought to you by U.S. Community Credit Union. In tonight's Music City Beat, modeling art after real life. Fox 17 Entertainment reporter Stacy McLeod has the true love story behind Rascal Flatts' hit song, Why Wait? Melody is catchy. Let's do it now and think about it later. And the video, which is a spoof of the movie The Hangover, is hilarious. But the inspiration behind Rascal Flatts' hit song Why Wait is actually quite the sappy love story. I've always been fond of her. I mean, honestly, I've always had a had a, a, a slight infatuation for her. So it really is a neat, it's a neat love story because it's so true. <laughs> Jimmy Yeary had been a songwriter in Nashville for many years, but on June 23, 2009, he had a writing session with Sonia Isaacs that literally changed his life. It was just very magical that day. It was just like there was a special, um, just already in place bond. Love don't need a reason. Ironically, it wasn't their first time working with each other. They spent a year on set together when Sonia was only 10 and Jimmy 14. I was living in Campton, Kentucky, and she was living in Morrow, Ohio. Mm -hmm. And uh, <clears throat> we traveled to a place called Bettyville, Kentucky, and sang together on a little TV station for about uh, a year, uh, about once a week. A love story 25 years in the making that only six months later would be the inspiration behind a very popular song. I just had this infectious, I thought, melody that I had, I wanted to put down. Jimmy was scheduled to write with Nashville songwriters Neil Thrasher and Tom Shapiro. During the session, Geary and Thrasher got on the subject of how they both tied the knot quickly into their relationships. We just took off on it, just mm -hmm. kind of just telling about just why wait, get married. Soon after, here he found himself telling specific details of he and Sonia's love story through an up-tempo country love song. The second verse says, I love your mama, let's save her some trouble. My mom loves that verse because, of course, it's all about her, you know. <laughs> I had that because I had the ring that she picked out in my pocket, and I actually uh, told her mom that I had it, and I was waiting for the time to, you know, to ask her. The writers went into the session with hopes that the Flats would cut the song. Not long after, they did, and it didn't take long for the world to relate to the lyrics, giving Yuri his very first number one. It's so much easier uh, to, to write a song when you're inspired. You can, you, you've, you can live it, you can go there, and you can kind of just tell the story. Jimmy and Sonia are hoping for a chart-topping hit together soon. They've written songs that will be released by Leanne Rimes, Martina McBride, and Heidi Newfield. And it looks like they will have even more subject matter to write about soon. There's a new chapter of their love story. They're expecting their first child in July. He's going to write songs and sing and play the guitar like his dad. Stacy McLeod, Fox 17 News. Oh, love that story. And Baby Yeary. Yeah, they are good, aren't they? Baby Yeary, that's the name, will probably pick up some talent from his mom as well. Isn't that awesome? Here's why. Here's yeah. what Stacy's talking about. You may not have recognized her, but that's actually Sonia Isaacs, Yeary, uh -huh. a part of the well-known okay. gospel group, The Isaacs.